Guys, just a heads up, always look at the date in the description on Squad Builder's prices because over the year the prices go up and down. Just a heads up and enjoy the video. Yo, what up everyone? How you doing? Welcome back to another video. Sorry, it's, be it's really late this upload, but I had to get this out. After I literally didn't do anything uh, on FIFA today and then I find out there's so much stuff. But we'll get into that in a little bit. Here's clip of the day. Tomorrow's video, check that out. 52 uh, rare player, gold packs, whatever you remember. Uh, there was... A Inform Strike Ronaldo packed in one of those, so we're gonna see what we can get in that. And there's actually turned out to be a lot more than 50 in the end. I opened those 15 and I did like an extra 10 and bits and pieces, so could be up to 60. Now, here's the squad. Like, I literally didn't go on FIFA all day, and then I, I go on suddenly, just out of the random, to see whether any packs were released. And then I see freaking Costa, right side RIP, I don't know what, Spider Man something kit, um, Payet, like unbelievable stuff has been released today. And I have built an a really special and fun squad a mixture of legends um, special players player of the matches Halloween I don't know helter skelter scary ass stuff but it's it's a ridiculously fun squad I thought let's make this like really creepy like Halloween I don't know why I said that but but yeah it turned out to be a really sick squad and you know what I'm gonna I never usually talk this early about top three but top three players in this, one of them is Gareth Barry. Like, unbelievable. I never thought he would be this good with the pace he has and his overall rating compared to who I have in this squad. Like, Mateus is usually ten times better. Well, he is better than Gareth Barry. But what I mean to say is, uh, Gareth Barry makes into the top three. Um, definitely. Like, he was just ridiculous. And Payet, of course, makes into the top three as well. But overall, this team was just ridiculous. I don't, I don't even know, like, what to say. But... I mean, obviously you're going to be like, hey, well, it has legends in it. But if you remove the legends, like, they're still really functional. Like, Lukaku is ridiculous. He's ridiculous, and I can't wait for his upgrade. And then Sun and Sterling, we've used him in a squad build a couple of days ago. They were fantastic. The defense is really good. I mean, Matip will also um, get an increase in uh, his rating. Uh, Rio Ferdinand. Uh, did I did I say the right name? Did I say Matip? Or, I feel like I said something wrong there, but I'm, I'm, uh, it might just be because it's really late over here at 2 a.m. But, yeah. Um, Hector Bellerin is going to get a massive upgrade. This team is so fun. It's ridiculous. Now, I usually build it like a normal squad build. Like, it starts off empty and I build it one by one. But just for this one, I just thought, you know what? I just want to... I don't want to build up the suspense i just want you to see it straight up because it's a ridiculous team now i am going to do a review on paya tomorrow and lukaku and i think some of you have been wanting so badly some new legends so i might do real ferdinand i might just do a, a review day tomorrow or i might do the pack opening tomorrow with the 50 uh, two rare players and then do the reviews uh the next day like a full five video um uh just outbreak in one day but yeah really fun squad right here we're going to play two quick games not the most uh I've not showed the most highlights in this because this team is obviously going to play great. But you do get around two minutes of footage in this or just about two minutes in a bit so you can enjoy and see how they play. But Lukaku is definitely one to be picked up. He's technically an inform. And then also if you buy him now, you'll also get him as a massive upgrade. What does he go to? 90 rated or something? Um, but yeah, very fun player to have as well. Uh, I think he's great this year. I think he's absolutely phenomenal this year. But Payet unbelievable what like what makes him amazing he just plays like he like he does in real life he's just so good with the ball got great long shots great free kicks hmm, might be a little hint there for you to see in a minute but uh, other than that i think he's really worth he does cost a lot though you need five scream halloween players and that's annoying and you also have to get under 75 chem which is doable but that's five players and right now it's expensive to do them now because they're they just came out but i was just really tempted to get going with this but it's sick. Check this out from Payet. Dimitri Payet. I just don't think you understand it went in. Like, unbelievable. I'm so lame. I'm sorry. But yeah, if you're new to my channel, subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to hit that like button as well. Another episode of Tiki Taka. I'm working on that. This time, I'm not going to do it like how I usually do it, where I just play two games and hope for the best. I'm going to actually work to get a really sick episode out. A much cheaper team as well, but obviously not like as expensive as this. But this is ridiculous. Such a fun team to use. I really want to name it the Halloween squad. It's, it's ridiculous. Now, I did put a squad builder disclaimer at the start where I say prices change over time, but I do that for every squad builder. This one isn't for you to make, really. This is just for fun out there. You know, it wouldn't shock me if uh, many of you can actually make this. There are people who also open a lot of packs and can afford these, but uh, this is genuinely a really sick team. Like, I really thought Gareth Barry would be the weak link in this team, but he is not. Hell no, he is brilliant. And Lukaku, a big, strong guy. Payet, great creativity. And he's in cam position. We've all been waiting for this. It's been a while since we've seen him in cam. So um, it's really nice to have an upgraded version of him in cam as well. Fantastic player. I can tell you from using him only for two or three games, he's ridiculous. Lovely goal there from Carlos. Carlos definitely should be in top three as well. Like, they should be a top ten right now. Because the only person... 
I would actually have to say I can put into a top 10 is probably Pantilim on the goalkeeper because I didn't get tested much with him because I was just so dominating with this team, obviously. Um, but the first game I played against, uh, the first team uh, was the second team, uh, which is a uh, bronze team, which is this one, yeah. And it wasn't the greatest, So, uh, but the first team was a decent team, so I gave him a good run. But yeah, winning this already 4-0, cruise control. But I hope you enjoyed this video. It was just more or less a fun video. I just wanted to show you some of the Halloweens, put a couple in there. And yeah, and uh, hope you mean you've enjoyed the video. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're new. Finishing off with the final goal of the game. Check this out. Boom. Uh, sweat. Yeah, I, I didn't even expect that. I, I bloody played this game and, <laughs> and I didn't even know I sweat. That I totally forgot. Excuse my language though. Um, I didn't mean to swear there. But yeah, have a wonderful day, guys. Peace. The clip of the day is back. I've already got another one. A sick one. As you can see, I've already picked one off there, two off there as well.